but there is still plenty of work to be done before the curtain rises on Cyrano for the first time. There's rehearsal, there, there's musical coaching, there's going to be French coaching, uh, there's going to be combat coaching, you know, and so there are going to be a lot of different elements and layers to the rehearsal schedule that, we, you know, it's a matrix, you know, you have to uh, really uh, coordinate this on a daily basis and, you know, to get all of these things in because, you know, once, I mean, the, the hourglass is going, right? It's a logistical nightmare getting 80 people fit in two weeks, especially because I want them all fit in the first week if I can. So I have a week to do the work and refit people. You know, that's what makes opera so challenging. Uh, it, uh, the very nature of it, because you're dealing with sets and costumes and scenery and, you know, the orchestra and the chorus and the supers and that's always the big challenge, is making sure that in the evolution of the production itself, that all of the pieces are coming together and uh, to, to bring, a, to bring a, a completeness. And uh, it's what makes opera exciting, because it can, anything can happen, not only in rehearsal, but in performance. It is fraught with potential disasters. I think time is always a great enemy when it comes to putting opera together, but particularly a new opera, because there are so many elements to work and to rehearse, and then you, you keep putting them together to another step and another step. So you're always fighting time. The power of music is powerful because it isn't words. It's sound that can evoke internal emotions. And when you tie it to words, then you have something that's very special. And that's what I think has been both the great mystery and the great art that opera provides for us. To find out more about Cyrano, visit michiganopera.org. This presentation is made possible by CompuWare, the leader in IT value. This program is also made possible by Dow, and by contributions to a PBS station by viewers like you. Thank you.